It is Jeff and track announcer Robert Geller with a look ahead to the mandatory payout of the Power Pick 6. And Robert, one thing I love about working with you is sometimes I think races are so simple and you say, Jeff, not so fast. Mm -hmm. For example, in the King Eddie, I think it's Cruden Bay and I think it's Philo de Ariana, but you say, no, let's toss in some prices. Well, let's toss in Wicked Django, who's been racing against Paramount Prince and I think likes turf. And what about War Bomber, who ran such a yeah. great race to be run down by Cruden Bay? They're my two long shots. And the Bull Venture Stakes, uh, Patches of Houlihan and Play Me a Tune. This is gonna be a bit of an acid test for Play Me a Tune. I think Patches is in incredible form. Patches of Houlihan even looks stronger, so I think those two probably got it covered there. Now we're a little light in the King's Plate, but if we're right, then we have coverage the rest of the way. Both you and I like Essex Serpent, but you're onto a bit of a pricier play in the Rafferu. Horse that's continually improving. I thought we're a really good second to my boy Prince, who's likely to be the favorite. But I'm with you on Essex Serpent. I expect a big run. Okay, bullets. We have high expectations for that one. She was dazzling. I think she takes aim, fires, hits the target. That one going post from the catch a glimpse. Then we get to race number 11. Now, this is a race that I don't see all that clearly. I think we have to spread in here a little bit. I do love Ron's Gizmo's ability on turf. Covered a lot of ground last start and was a very good second. I think there are a number of chances. So I also went deeper with horses like Clear Destination and Cool Kiss. And I want to use Never Surprise because of that inside draw. And then we're going to wrap it up in race number 12. I like Xena Swift, but we also want to toss in Ryo Amazing. This horse was a little unlucky. Made a big sweeping run and then seemed to just peter out. But I think there's more in the tank at this level. It is a mandatory payout when it comes to the jackpot power pick six on King's Plate Day version 2.0. <laughs>